the one I'm two back here, and welcome back to Chrono Trigger. Where last I thought we ended up here at the Toronto Lair and took out Minsville and a shit ton of fucking blizzards. Just like what's about to happen right now. Oh yeah, and then these little shits too. Yeah, these too. It's hilarious. That is, that is not funny, that's hilarious. <laughs> I know what you mean. Oh, I know what you mean. Fill out the sticker, but it still keeps kind of peeling. Oh my god. Okay, three switches. Uh, let's see. Oh! Fun! Ooh! Somebody learned a new uh, technique. Uh, let's see. Lynn, water two, and tier two is right, right above that, too. Well, right below that. That's about to 592 uh, tech points. Okay. Ooh! I do save for it. That was dumb. Here. Let's just do this real quick. Because, uh, I am kind of low. Uh, yeah. Definitely need to. Definitely should at least travel back in time and do something like shopping. Oh, look at that. Two more. Okay. Two dinosaurs. And another one. That three. Yeah, th three uh, 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 pterosaurs. Oh, there she is. And that is the final confrontation. But it was a matter of time. I have a. It will be. We reptiles will inherit the earth. You. Or you soft skinned apes. I let strong live. We die. I let just fight. Yep. Hear that lucky voice? You'll soon be hearing more of it than you'll ever wish. She can jump, man. You gotta wonder if she actually uses her own eggs to actually use for these uh, treasure chests too. Triceratops. That's for holy shit. That's for uh, that's for T260. You know what? No wait, that's actually a, a helmet. You know what? I'm gonna give him this armor because he doesn't have the best armor with it. But actually, you know what? He's actually got the more appropriate armor because the ruby does. We're gonna have to be dealing with fire. Yeah, fire. Okay. Let's see. Speed belt, magic scar. Let's make sure we're properly equipped. Yeah, he's okay with the heroes, man. He'll be okay with that. Yeah, we'll be okay, we'll be okay. Alright, there goes the star. Tell him the red star. Fall away, don't you? Stay in the earth red. I'm pretty sure she can tell me the reason. Alrighty. Okay, here we go. This will be fun too. You know this is important too, because it's the size of that one too. So, Azala is our target. I'll just do that too.
out of order. I wasn't trying to block off that one of those. It's not gonna be that huge, but it was a huge boulder. It was huge. Oh yeah, and then there's that. Take this the other side. Oh yeah, she'll be okay. Yeah, she'll be okay. We're just messing up that. Psychokinesis. I ain't that crazy. I mean, I'm a real seeker, but I ain't that crazy.
up on somebody, then he'll something as well. Start with the tongue out. <laughs> no, it can't be. Could the heavens truly have sided with the apes? Listen, primates, and let it be known for all time. We reptites fought proudly to the bitter end. appreciate the mode 7 though. I'll always appreciate mode 7. And this is classic, you know, SNES style too. You know, 2D with a little bit of mode 7 rolling in it too. I let people word. La means fire. Post means big. In other words, a big fire. But you know what? Isla showed sympathy, and that's like a good one. Isla showed, she showed, uh, not sympathy though, she showed. Yeah. She showed the Oh, yeah. I don't know if you can't hear that in the background, but Lavos is buried millions and millions and millions of feet underground. Lovus was not spawned by Magus. It fell from the heavens so long ago.
Hmm. Lavos huge. Chrono fight it? Not yet. We go place Lavos full. Seems like a smart thing to do. Hmm. Left to its own devices, the creature will burrow deep into the earth. Best to defeat it now. You know what? In retrospect, it pretty much is. Would you look at that? Huh. A gate? Huh. Lava fast, deep under earth now. My levels be the source of these? Well, that one of Magus' lair was immense. What's wrong, Colonel? Fight levels here, no? Well, you know what? Let's take a look what's going on real quick. You know, Isla's good. I do, you know, I do need to have uh, Luca in too, so let's have a look at what's going on beyond this, uh, beyond this port, this gate. Right in the middle of the Ice Age, too. Right smack dab in the middle. Let's go check out what this guy right now is happening on the surface, too. And right to the sky we go. Ladies and gentlemen, we are in the kingdom of Zeal. This town is called Inhasa. Look at that. Her name is, uh, oh, this is the Magic Kingdom of Zeal, where dreams can, can be made a reality. Nothing in this world comes for free. There's always a price to be paid. <laughs> I love when Dory just disappears like that. This is the Magic Kingdom of Zeal. Welcome to Anhasa, Zeal City of Dreams. We seek enlightenment within the place of sleep. You're not of us, are you? They, they seek enlightenment from sleep. You know, and, you know, the Hindu people who are Hindu, people who are of a, of a Hindu religion, they seek enlightenment through meditation. You are most unusual visitors. Am I waking, or is this a continuation of my dream? Regardless of that, I welcome you to Zeal. Her Majesty Queen Zeal rules this magic kingdom. She is without peer in beauty or grace. You are prosperity to Her Majesty the Queen. After the king died, she incurs the development of her kingdom's magical prowess, which can be led to great advancements, and she goes right back to sleep. I wish I could sleep all day, but man, life would be boring. The world you see with your eyes well, they will differ completely from the one seen within mine. There are many different worlds as there are observers. Never assume that only all of those things which you can see or touch are real. Hmm. Do you think such thing as fate? Do you think it's possible for our lives to be predetermined? Can I believe it too, perhaps? Is it ignorant to think ourselves strong enough to be overturned destiny? To overturn destiny? You know what? Oh, no wonder. That's ridiculous. Yes, it is, isn't it? We are the masters of our own destinies. And that's very true, too. Speaking of which, I believe there may be a doorway of destiny in this very place. Let's see what it says if it's done your business. Ah. Truth exists in dreams. World exists in me. Okay, these magic users are but nothing but a, a bunch of lazy uh, wizards at this point. If you want to look at it. Of course. The city of Kajar, the high city of magical research, lies on the edge of the western continent. The airship, the Blackbird, is maintained there as well. Right back to sleep. And there's a boy there. Hey, what's wrong? Do you have something to say? He seems a sullen lad. The lad seems pretty sullen. The Black Wind Hounds. One among you will shortly perish. Young one, of what do you speak? I don't know what this portends, but I do not like the sound of the It's only a bad joke. Prophecy is completely unscientific. Well, scientific, actually. Sorry. No, that did sound pretty good uh, in Glenn's voice. Front of recovery, rest your weary mind and body within, Traveler. I want to go to the Lord's Shrine. I've got the key to unlock its seal at the palace, but it's there strictly forbidden by her name and the queen. What's up? Alright. Queen's Palace sits in the corner of the kingdom. Not so rose on my vantage point. You can sleep 
four days away. Peace. Okay, well, that, that makes sense, if you will. Let's see. Oh. And there's, a uh, there she is. I'm Doreen. I seek the hidden path to open the doors of knowledge. Eat and turn. The door to the Northern Shrine is sealed by the powerful force. Even we the enlightened ones lack the means of the Zelfers. Welcome, have you come to do business? Yes, we have, actually. I need plenty of these. Plenty of these. There's a saying here. Water creates wind. Remember this, everybody. And this is also scientific. Water creates wind. And wind, in turn, makes fire dance. There's your door of destiny right here. And this says, The Mystery Live, Volume 4, 841, Chapter 26. All life begins and ends with new. This is the undeniable truth because I believe it to be so, or at least for the present. <gasps> the groove reason is gone. Do you want to challenge me? Yes. And you know what? Let's do a challenge before we end this episode. How about that? Alright, prepare yourself. You remember the news from the forest? Well, they originated here. <laughs> this will be fun. Don't be afraid. Remember, they hit you, they hit you on the one inch pool, they hit you again, and you go down. But if they hit you a third time consecutively, then you're done. They've switched that. Oh no, that's not good. Oh no, that's not good. by a bunch of news. No, 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 no. You know what? That's actually the very first time in my life that I've actually been beaten by the news. I can't go back in. Oh, no. Hold on. Hold on a second. You know what? Mulligan. We'll call that a mulligan. How about that? Yeah, they've definitely changed this up, you know, from the SNES version. Even the DS version didn't even have this, too. Oh, no. There we go.
down at that when you think about it. Capsule. And in the next episode, we continue Magical Kingdom of Zeal. Much love, and I'll see you in the next episode. Peace!